Yo guys, what's going on? I'm Tim for MLB Baseball Blogs, and it has been made clear according to MLBTradeRumors.com that the Braves will acquire a hitter prior to the deadline. And we've heard a lot of names. I think the, the obvious names are Carlos Beltran. That doesn't seem likely, according to Ken Rosenthal. Uh, Hunter Pence, they're not huge fans of. And, I mean, the the real reason the Braves have needed an outfielder is because they need another hitter. That, uh, the guys they've brought in have not necessarily worked out. I think if you look at Dan Ugla, he's been a huge disappointment. He could certainly turn out to have a much better second half, but I don't think the Braves are ready to take that chance. And I think Jason Hayward's had a really tough sophomore season. But the names that the Braves, the two names that I'm looking at with the Braves that they could really go get. And I know B.J. Upton's another name out there. I don't think that's likely. The two names I'm really looking at are Johnny Gomes of the Reds and Ryan Ludwig of the Padres. Now, both of these guys are having somewhat down seasons. Johnny Gomes is never someone who's hit for average. He has a 244 career average, but he's batting 215 this season. This is a guy who's hit over 20 home runs three times in his career. Uh, last season he had 18 home runs and he can really provide a spark to a team. He's one of those guys that goes out there every single game and works hard and plays 100% and never quits. I think that's the best way to put it. So maybe that is the best way to put it. I think Johnny Gomes is very realistic, but I think the main issue will end up being the fact that um the Reds aren't sure if they're going to be contenders or not, and I think in that division it would be silly to trade away a player who can uh, help impact your second half of the season. Now, for the Padres, Ryan Ludwig becomes an, uh, the more likely name. Now, he's going to take a bit more of a package to get him. The, he's not going to take the Hunter Pence where you got to trade away the whole farm system to get him. J Ryan Ludwig is probably going to take a team's like third best prospect something in that area I don't know exactly what position it would be but he's gonna give you some production I mean this guy's hit 37 home runs in his career before and while that number's going down he's 33 years old I don't think he's making a ton of money and he's having a pretty good season and remember he's doing this in Petco Park so Turner Field's another big stadium. I think we see guys like Dan Ugla struggle to keep hitting home runs. You know you're going to get some home runs with Ryan Ludwig even moving into Turner Field because it's actually smaller than Petco Park. But I, I think that Ryan Ludwig will end up a brave. I think that uh, he's one of the key guys out there right now. And it makes the most sense for the Braves to go get a guy like Ryan Ludwig. He's a veteran presence. He can probably play both right and left field. So if Jason Hayward really struggles, you can have him in right. If not, you can put him in left. So Ryan Ludwig will go to the Braves. You're hearing that here first on the best MLB coverage on YouTube, MLB Baseball Blogs.